Hi everyone, happy Bank Holiday Monday. For this week's plan with me, I'm using a kit from Stick It Pretty. It just had full boxes and the washi sheet. And I'm also going to be bringing in last week's new release, which were these pop it lined full boxes. So cute and adorable. And then the washi that I'm going to be using is this floral one here to bring in some of the florals from the kit and the bow washi, and they're from Simply Gilded. And then a last minute addition were my Poppet date covers, which you guys have seen me use before. And that's because I had a lot of purple in my planner, so I wanted to pull in some of the purple and pinks from the kit. I also decided to white out the dates at the top before I put my date covers down, which I don't always do, but I did. So I hope everybody had a lovely Easter. I um, was so busy last week doing all of my sale orders that I didn't actually get around to buying the children Easter eggs. So I went on a mad dash on Sunday morning and everywhere was completely shut, obviously. Uh, but I did manage to find a shop open and paid a ridiculous amount for some Easter eggs. So um, I, they did have Easter eggs in the end. I mean, my children are a little bit older, but, um, you know, you still got to have Easter eggs. It doesn't matter how old you are. But I normally would do a Easter egg hunt with kind of rhyming clues. I think I moan about it every year because they have like 10 clues each. So that's 30 clues that I have to try and come up with that rhyme. And I, I just did not have the time because obviously I was so busy last week. So um, I decided to do charades <laughs> and I acted out uh, clues for them to find their eggs, which, um, you know, it, it was kind of hilarious. They had a good time. They've got some eggs, so it all worked out in the end. In other news, I've actually remembered to mute my phone. So that's the first time in history that my phone won't go off in my um, video. So give me a thumbs up on the video for that. Okay, moving on to day by day. So first thing is instead of writing Hello Monday, I wrote Hello Bank Holiday. I then decided to use one of my new Pop It Full boxes. And for this week, I'm going to be using them as check boxes or creating my own. These are so versatile, you can use them for literally anything. The little poppet that is up by Hello Bank Holiday is from the floral sheet. I then decided to take some of the washi from the kit just to, I don't know, kind of make it match. <laughs> and then underneath there, I've taken the poppets with the popcorn um, from the friend sheet as we're going to be having a movie day today. Um, probably eating all of our Easter eggs, you know, yeah, you know how it is the day after Easter. Everybody eats everything, feels a little bit sick, a little bit full and kind of fed up with everything. So I've used the poppets from the stuffed sheet as, yeah, that's pretty much how we're going to look by the end of today. And then moving on to Tuesday, I started with the full box up at the top and then underneath there I've put one of the poppets from the feeling sheet as I need to post absolutely everything. So my post office was shut on Friday, it opens back up on Tuesday. I have, I don't know, 72 uh, orders I think that need to be posted so my post office is going to love me. I've also got my food shop delivery so I've used a poppet from the food sheet. The silhouette cutting machine is from Autumn Craft. Autumn Crafting? No, Autumn Craft. And I wanted to take some Instagram pictures and the little camera there is from Planning Dreams. I also need to edit a video ready for Wednesday. And then the foiled bow is from Diamond Print Designs. And I need to order some inserts for my new planner and of course other pretty things because you can't just shop for one thing, can you? Well, I can't anyway. I've been buying so much stuff from um, D Stash groups on Facebook. It's kind of like my guilt free shopping because I feel like I'm helping somebody out with, you know, maybe they need space or money. So I'm buying it from them. So I'm actually helping people. I feel that way about charity shops. They're my guilt free shopping because even if I'm spending a ridiculous amount, I'm giving it to charity. For Wednesday, I've got a delivery due, so I used a poppet from the Happy Mail sheet. I then put another one of the poppet full boxes down and created a little checklist of things that I need to do. So I think it was just housework, laundry, and I need to go over the school emails ready for when they go back next week to make sure I'm all up to date on newsletters and things that are happening next week. And then um, I myself am going back to work, so I've put a pop it down from the headache sheet as I've got forms to fill in before I go back to work. And then I want to upload my tiny planner, so for that I've used a little 
film clapper and that is from rose colored days so excited about this week's uh, tiny planner it came out really cute then i've got to pack some orders so i've got a pop it from the post and deliver sheet and then i'm going to be posting them so the post office one is from the post and deliver sheet as well and then after I've posted the orders, I want to go and treat myself and grab a coffee. So uh, the post-it note is from, oh, I can't remember where the post-it note's from. I think it's from Planner Monkey Co. And then I'll just put one of my tiny poppets in there. And then for Thursday, I've put a full box up at the top. And then I need to get my work clothes ready. So I've just put a little poppet from the laundry sheet down. And then I want to update my bullet journal. So I was so late setting up April that I need to transfer everything that I've kind of written down waiting to put into my bullet journal until I'd actually created April. So I need to go through and do that. And then I've put a, another poppet full box down at the bottom. And then I remembered I need to put down my bin day poppet. I was going to put a bit of washi behind it, but I decided not to. Um, so for me this week, it is my black bins. And then I'm just going to create my little to-do. So this is kind of me getting stuff ready for work on Friday. So I need my ID card, my lanyard, my keys. I was trying to think what it was that I needed because it's been so long since I've gone back. Um, there's probably things I've forgotten. And then for Friday is when I go back to work. So I've put a crying poppet down because I kind of don't want to go back to work. <laughs> I'm not one of those people that has their dream job or anything. I kind of, you know, I'm sad to go back. Um, I've put a poppet down from the pack lunch poppets to remind myself to take a lunch and then obviously because I'm going to be at work I haven't got any plans really for Friday so I've put my full box down I am going to go and buy some fresh pizzas after work on Friday um, for dinner and then after that I can go and pick up my daughter and then moving over to Saturday I decided to put my full boxes down first so I've put them down the bottom this week and I just put Sundays down there while I was there. And then moving back up to the top on Saturday, I used a piece of washi and then a doodle sticker from the, I can't remember what it's called, coffee and toast, that was it, coffee and toast doodle sheet. You'd think I'd know all of my names of my own stickers. Um, I just wrote but first coffee because I want to film next week's tiny planner. And then for Saturday, I'm going to be doing housework pretty much all day, so, um, I've just put one poppet down and written down housework and then I'm going to go and visit my mum and dad so I've used the poppet from the couples sheet. I'm really excited to go and see my parents at the weekend because my dad hasn't been very well. He uh, was in hospital for a couple of days. I mean I've spoken to him on the phone and we've video chatted but I'm excited to go down and actually see them. And then for Sunday I want to film next week's plan with me. I've used a poppet from the DIY sheet as we're going to pick up more paint. I feel like all we do is decorate. <laughs> um, and then hopefully we'll stop at McDonald's. So I used a poppet with the burger from the takeaway sheet. And then moving on to my sidebar, I put my full box up at the top and then I decided to use the washi because it was really pretty. So I've just put it down as kind of a background although I literally cover all of this up. So I've got these headers from Simply Gilded. So I decided to use the rest of my Poppet full boxes and kind of create separate sections. Really, I only need work and home just to track things or write things down. But there was another header that says play. So I thought, why not? We'll just, we'll stick that in the bottom. I'll probably use that to track things that I'm buying from d -stashes. <laughs> And then there was a little bit of deco, so I decided to stick that all the way along the top. And also I'm going to be hopefully bringing up new planner videos. So I've got my B6 that I'm trying to find inserts for. I'm not sure if I'm going to do printable or if I'm going to create my own, but hopefully they will pop up soon. <laughs> my daughter's talking to the cat. Um, but anyway, that was it for this week's spread. Oh, I did at the bottom, off camera, I put the get tested, the COVID test stickers, uh, because my son needs to do those two tests and I forgot to add those in. But other than that, I hope you have enjoyed the video. Make sure you give me a thumbs up if you did. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll speak to you all next time. Bye guys.